Here is my latest addition. It's a little plate coral that I picked up from uh, from Aqua Pros in Glen Ellen. It is an amazing shop. If you haven't been out there, you really need to check it out. His prices are just astounding. And the quality of the stuff, well, this is a uh, an Australian, I believe it was a wagon wheel plate coral. I just threw some rods, food in there, and it is just good. It's going to town on it. Um, I hope this is focusing okay. Unfortunately, my little flip camera I don't think is made for the close-up stuff. Um, but it's very cool. You can see the little tentacles um, and some of the rods, food. I'm still loving my Maxi Mini Anemone. Um, it's got a little piece of food in there. I wonder. I don't know. It actually um, it ate some earlier today, so I don't know if it will do anything with that or just end up letting that go. Um, here's my other latest addition from from Aqua Pros. There's my uh, Acropora. Um, yeah, I need to clean my glass. And ended up moving my uh, my bird's nest over. I don't know if you saw my previous video used to be right about there moved it up there to end up making some room for the Acropora that will now go over there and that will end up being in the path of the power head to give it some good flow um, hopefully the bird's nest is going to do okay over there perhaps it will end up getting getting moved again um, let me see the fire you didn't see the firefish last time, and I finally got one of them out this time with a little bit of food in the water. My little uh, emerald crab is poking around down there. Not going to be enough light, but you can see a leg there. You can see most of the food is gone from the plate coral. It's been pulled in. Hank is doing well. I just had a uh, just had a lady over today. Got a bag of chato, and she was admiring some of the. I think they're called giant polyps. If anyone knows differently, feel free to let me know. The big white ones, which there's food in the water, so they've all tried grabbing some. Uh, but there was one right there. I snapped a little piece of rock off for her. Um, for Karen, hope you enjoy that. Otherwise, things are looking really good. Anyone looking for some Kenya trees? Let me know. Actually, I just I just put one on a frag plug. I was I was showing showing Karen um, the uh, um, super glue gel, how all that works underwater. There's my little emerald. Yeah, he's playing shy. There, this rod's food. I cannot speak highly enough for it. Everyone comes out for something. There's the two firefish. Oh, you might actually be able to see it. Firefish and six line wrasse. On the lawnmower was just out. And then the pajama cardinal, who's who is of course of course gone gone into hiding now. Um, the Yuma I picked up from Aqua Pros. The one main one has been shrinking a little bit. I'm trying some different areas of flow. But there is another one that is starting up and around the back in a little bit darker area. I have one and right there is another one. So I've got a total of four Yumas on the one rock here. Cannot thank Aqua Pros enough for that. Absolutely wonderful. There is the Pajama Cardinal. Got him from uh, from Bad Gus on Reef Central. Really nice guy. Kind of the latest update. Everything is looking really good. And I finally got a coral for the bottom now.